So Grammys went well? I would say so. I had a you? You were a very kind of, like you came up to accept your award and kind of mellow though. Like they tell you. Well, like, you know, to be out. honest, to be honest, I really didn't think that we were gonna win anything. We were afraid that we were gonna win anything. Last time, with our last record, we were nominated for five categories and we didn't win shit. And so this time it was like, oh really, another five? God, I hope we at least get one because if we lose two years, two records in a row. Losing fucking five, that would suck. So I was like, God, I hope we at least get one just to redeem ourselves somehow to ourselves. We won one in the, and then we got one in the pre-show. We won one, and then we thought like, okay, that's great, fuck it. And but that the one on TV, it was that's the like Bruce bug. Springsteen and Fogarty and all. Beat it. Real Shoot. artists, you know. Yeah. And uh, so we didn't get murdered. Were you sitting around any of those guys? Yep. Fogarty tried to punch me in the face. I hear he's a fighter. And he's a brawler. I know. You know that? I do know that. Herbie Hancock get on you backstage? Uh, he yeah. Throw down. yeah. He, uh, knife. Um, he had <laughs> weapons. <laughs> <laughs> he had an axe. <laughs> and he fucking wielded it. <laughs> All animatronic robots had weapons. It was kind of spooky. Yeah. yeah. Is, are the Grammys just like bullshit at this point? Like, I mean, do you have one? You put it up on the mantle, and like, do you care? Oh, no, yeah. dude, it's awesome, yeah. dude. Sure, it is. I don't yeah. know. I've never won one. Here's the thing. Here's the thing. Is that Taylor's gonna get me right now? It's not a competition. I really, I'm gonna do. But you mean bullshit, man? <laughs> <laughs> like Grammys are, you know, it, they're not like um, Nickelodeon awards. Oh. Like the people, you know, you kids' choice. If you, if you get if you get nominated really? for a Grammy, in a way, it makes you feel. It, it makes you feel good because you're being recognized as a, as a musician, you know, and or as a songwriter or whatever. And so in that in that respect, it does really kind of feel good. And then when you win one, you're sort of like, well, and it's you know, when the family comes over for dinner, they you fucking polish them up. But the parents are really proud of those. Things. The set parents love the Grammy. It's like for, I have it for the longest time. I used a Grammy to hold my bedroom door open because it never would stay open. And uh, now I have them on a shelf. So <laughs> way to take care. Yeah. Uh, we uh, saw you a few years ago, speaking of your family, and uh, Special Ed and I were at this concert in D.C., and we were offended uh, by your language. Highly. Highly offended oh, by your language. Oh, did I say nasty stuff? You said some dirty things. Uh, and your mother was in the audience. Yeah, well, she's used to it, man. Where did your love of profanity come from? Uh, well, probably acid. Because um, <laughs> when I used to take acid and stuff, I would just fucking cuss at people. Like, I'd cuss at old ladies. It was bad. I'd say really nasty I mean, shit they, to they senior citizens. It. What's that? They deserve it. I mean, they've lived Well, when you're tripping, it's like, God, you want to see the funniest thing in the world? And fuck you, bitch. <laughs> and like, you know, and it was really funny. So I That's think great. it's like Tourette's and <laughs> yeah, Caffeine awesome. sometimes no, will like no, throw me in it. Or tomorrow. like while yeah. playing. Uh, <laughs> fuck you, but, bitch. Yeah. So, but I cool it around my kid. So. But if it's your kid, I don't fucking care. Yeah. <laughs> There's a bunch of kids. Yeah. Well, no, the kid's coming tomorrow. Huh? He doesn't know even your what the word is. Yeah. You, you, dude, believe me, they'll <laughs> fucking catch on super quick. My daughter caught on like that. I, I let, know. I let you a drop, shit I know you drop slip bombs all day once. Long too. I don't, dude, around her. I swear, I can cool it. I can cut it off. I can stop it. I can pinch it. It's a tip. Well, Fletcher's kind of arguing, like, so. Yeah. If you can no, yeah. It down yeah. Yeah. Pinch that turd off at the end. Dude, I mean, honestly, if you get... Creative cussing, like if you get really good at cussing and you start making up your shut the front door. <laughs> no, like that. Do you know that new commercial where the guy walks in, and the girl walks in, she goes, the guy says, uh, he says, what the French toast? Have you seen that? Uh, uh, that's kind of same thing. There's no good story. <laughs> it's like say, uh, shut the front door. Right. Shut the front door. Shut the front door. So where did where did Davy Grolton come from? Like what? That's my name. You, you take all credit for that? Uh, it's great. The video's fantastic, so. Thanks. We actually it's have Taylor's that. idea. You came up with all of that? No. You kind of did, though. Yeah, but I mean, it didn't. It, <laughs> it, 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 it's, still, it's, still, it's still a work in progress. What do you mean? It's already on TV and shit. I know. <laughs> What did you mean by what like, is, there whole, is there a whole concept? Like, I don't know. Explain it's, what yeah, you just okay. said. Well, it's, well, I meant was <laughs> yeah, I feel like stuff? we I feel like we got it eighty percent. There's a couple things that we just yeah, love, it's, but, I love, but I love it. That's great. Like how do you how do you maintain that that fun factor? Like doing what you do. There's so many like, self-important <laughs> fan. I, I don't know. Show, show it's old and over. <laughs> Like how do you, <laughs> there it is again. the fun factor? Like how do you stay fun? Like when everyone else is like self-important rock stuff. Stay fun, dude. We just stay fun. We just stay fun. You know when I when I feel like Dave's getting too big for his boots, I just knock him down. <laughs>
Like, so, man, you gotta cool it and stop taking yourself so seriously. Like, Get real, just, man. We all do the same thing. <laughs> Look after each other that way, you know? We're all brothers, Which, which man. interview are you quoting right now? <laughs> <laughs> like some fucking queen interview. <laughs> Uh, there's there's rumors too uh, about Led, Led Zeppelin doing the reunion, and I know Dave, you would you would love to drum for Led Zeppelin. He'd suck a cock for that. <laughs> <laughs> he would suck like all in the of everybody's cocks. Like, uh, like, and spin on it, do a little bit of salad one, tossing. One, not any chance. I, I would suck dicks for that kid. <laughs> <Totally. laughs> he might even take an ass. <laughs> well, maybe for a whole tour. So if they came home. Huh? If they came call us. Yeah, I think anybody. I mean, honestly, I any German. Fuck no. I, yeah. Yeah, because yeah, yeah, you're the food fighter. No, I couldn't handle that pressure. I would just have a heart attack the day of the first show. You could do it. You could do it! There's lots of other things. I, w I wouldn't want it. Bottom's too sacred.